Guy Verkstadt with um, Rick. He's a co counselor at Volcan. We're taking a look at some of the behind the scenes making of Volcan. So, Rick, tell me a little bit about um, some of the props that you have here. Um, this this is um, actually almost finished. Uh, I still have the um, stock to make for it, but this is a 40 millimeter uh, fictional Russian grenade launcher from uh, the world of dust created by Paolo Parente. Um, this will be carried by one of our costume characters. We'll be portraying Anastasia. And what you're holding in your hand there is a broom handle 712 Mauser. Um, it is a prop for the character Angel, which you will be playing as one of the Dust Girls. Um, she is a Blitkrutz assassin and sniper. And this behind me here are a couple of giant wrenches that go with a bazooka for um, an American character named Rosie. Um, she's an American engineer and uh, she also is another Dust Girl. And all of these characters will be um, present at Vulcan in celebration of Dust Day. Excellent. So um, tell me a little bit about these characters and why you, you know, want to bring them out. What are you celebrating with them? Well, um, it's, a, it's a new game by Fantasy Flight. It's only about a year old. Um, and I'm... Myself and Jay are big fans of Paula Parente, the creator of the original Dust World. It's basically an alternate universe Second World War setting that takes place in about 1947, 1948, long after the real war ended, but in his world it's still going on. They've found alien technology, they've incorporated it into their weaponry, um, and there's walking machines, there's jet aircraft, there's helicopters, there's things that they shouldn't have in World War II that um, are present in the in in the dust world, including zombies and and genetically altered apes and things like that. When we decided to do a con, because it's one of my personal favorites and one of Jay's personal favorites, we said, well this has to be a big feature. Um, in Argentina they had just had a the first dust day and um, we thought, let's make ours the second. So we contacted Paulo, we contacted a fantasy flight, and we have the second official dust day in the world. Excellent. Well, we're all super excited for that. So there you have your first look here with Tony Darling and Rick, co-counselor of Volcon, um, at the making of Volcon. We'll be back to see you guys soon with some more progress. Make sure you click the link to pre-register for Volcon. <laughs>